Hi guys, today I'm going to try top coat F11 for the first time on a black Sentra which has some swirl marks. Um, I'm a little bit skeptical so I went on eBay and bought a three ounce bottle and the microfiber towel as you can see that came with it for approximately 16 bucks rather than springing the 60 or 70 for the, uh, the kit. So this is the first time we're going to be applying it. We'll see what happens. Because I wanted to ensure that I had enough microfiber towels to do the job, I went out to the dollar store and I bought a couple of, uh, after you know, just plain old microfiber towels. And I'm noticing that these seem to be a, quite a bit thicker than the one that came with my three ounce bottle of F11. Okay, well, I followed the instructions and rubbed it in, sprayed it on, rubbed it in, and buffed it out using a clean microfiber cloth for the buffing part of it. And here we are looking at the trunk, which I think, if you compare it to, say, the, the fender over here versus what the trunk looks like, I didn't do the fender. Uh, I see, I think, an appreciably, appreciably shinier surface with a, still a few swirls. Now, the telling one is going to be up here in the front where I did the left-hand side of the trunk, but I didn't do the right-hand side of the trunk. So let's see what we're left with. We still do have swirls, which means to me probably I'll have to have it clayed. But over here, where I didn't do it at all, we really do see quite a difference, don't we? So with this, I'm going to say that this does have an effect. Uh, maybe enough so that I can forget about having this thing clayed and buffed for a while. But I think a second uh, application of top coat would be good as well. So I'll do that in another few days. One final note, I used about that much F11 to do one coat on the trunk and one coat on the hood. And here once again is the result of that one coat on the hood. As you can see, it doesn't eradicate the swirls, but in my opinion, it makes them about 50% less noticeable. Okay, and just because I knew you guys were just dying to know the final outcome of this little experiment, I went ahead and put the second coat on right away so I could document it in this video as well. And as you can see, you can still see swirls. They're not as bad as they were. I'd say we now have about a 60% reduction. So uh, F11, yeah, okay. Not too bad, but at some point I'm still going to have to have this car uh, buffed and treated. But for a first pass with such bad swirls, nah, not too bad for 15 bucks. Talk to you later.